Hello students, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to share unit wise important questions of chemistry R23 JNTUK. Unit 1 Structure and Bonding Models. Schrodinger Wave Equation Significance of Xi and Xi Square. Second question Particle in one dimensional box. Third question Molecular orbital diagram of CO or energy level diagram of CO. And molecular orbital diagram of O2 or energy level diagram of O2. Fifth question, pi molecular orbital diagram of benzene. Sixth question, pi molecular orbital diagram of 1,3-butadiene. Seventh question, fundamentals of quantum mechanics. And eighth question, molecular orbital theory. Coming to the unit 2, it is known as modern engineering materials. Important questions include carbon nanotubes so with respect to carbon nanotubes types properties and applications are very very important fullerenes structure types properties and applications third question superconductors types and applications john defining for the preparation of semiconductors at the same time jokrelsky crystal pulling technique along with the applications of semiconductors Coming to the super capacitors, types and applications are important. Coming to unit 3, it is called as electrochemistry and applications. First question is Nernest equation. Second one is dry or Leclanche cell. Third question is hydrogen oxygen fuel cell. Fourth question is conductometric titrations. Fifth question is potentiometric titrations. Sixth question is lithium ion battery. 7th question is zinc air battery, 8th question is polymer electrolyte membrane fuel cell and 9th question is potentiometric sensors. Coming to unit 4 which is called as polymer chemistry, the most important question includes preparation properties and applications of bakelite, teflon, pvc, buna s rubber, buna n rubber and nylon 66. Second question, differences between thermoplastics and thermosetting plastics. Third question, types of polymerization, in particular addition and condensation polymerization. Fourth question is coordination or ziegler natta polymerization. Fifth question is emulsion polymerization. Sixth question is suspension polymerization. Seventh question is conducting polymers, especially the mechanism of conduction. And the eighth question is biodegradable polymers. Coming to the fifth unit, it is called as instrumental methods and applications. First question is Beer's Lambert's law. Second one is instrumentation of UV spectroscopy. Third one is instrumentation of IR spectroscopy. Fourth one is electronic transitions. Fifth one is instrumentation of HPLC along with its applications. Sixth one is chromatography and its classification. Seventh one is UV spectroscopy and its applications. And eighth one is IR spectroscopy and its applications. If you like the video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.